Oh baby, we back with another universe mode video and we open up with Edge and AJ Styles and their weird alliance that I have no idea how to explain. Last week we figured out that Edge has been basically controlling AJ Styles this entire time when AJ defeated Akira Tozawa in quick fashion. Now Edge and AJ Styles will team up for the first time since this controlling situation happened and they'll be going up against the street profits montez ford and angelo dawkins street profits weren't able to pick up the tag titles in the raw tag team gauntlet but they got a chance at defeating this new alliance of edge and aj styles by aj styles and enziguri up to the top rope what's he doing whoa whoa montez is in the ring i don't know why he's going for a move oh no montez and a big splash from angelo send him into the corner we're gonna get a little tag team action some duos some some tandem offense here off the rough flapjack double flapjack the shooting star press went for the super kick but he caught his leg edge gonna tear apart not edge aj gonna tear up those limbs speaking of edge oh went for a super kick but he's caught him into an electric chair edge is now in the match now ddt from Edge, and now he's cheering to the crowd, he's cheering to the ref, but Montez Ford kips up, he's gonna roll through into his own pin, he might catch Edge, oh, he might catch Edge off guard, but no, he could not, big single leg drop kick though from Edge, now we're gonna send him in the corner, went for some tag team offense, but Montez is gonna send Ed Edge into the corner, now we got Angelo and Montez doing more tag team offense, and he's, he's shimmying, he's ducking, he's got him, Angelo running off the ropes, that's a big boy, the leapfrog, oh my, send him off the ropes, flapjack of his own, and now gonna bring him back, no, Edge, fighting through this here we go send him into the corner We're gonna get some tag team offense from edge and aj they've teamed up before but this was before this situation happened i guess Edge has been teaching aj how to do the spear and now he's gonna go for the calf killer this finished off of carriages all last week but montez ford is right there to break things up angelo sends him off here oh spear spear from angelo dawkins going for that spine buster but no aj somehow able to fight out of it after that big old spear and now edge AJ, I, I'm messing them up somehow. I don't know why I'm doing this, but big combinations. Close line from AJ. Send him out onto the apron. No, he kicks off Edge. Edge trying to go. Oh, 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 oh. Sent on. He went after Montez, but Montez fights off. Another big combinations. The strikes from Angelo. Big shot takes him out. But no, AJ fights out of the corner. And now look at him. He's got him for the Styles Clash. Styles Clash to Angelo. Edge and Montez gonna enter the ring trying to break this pin up. Could this be it? No, Angelo somehow able to kick out. Nobody even broke out anything, but Edge is in the match. Execution. Execution. But no, Dawkins, how are you still here? Big kick. Tag to Montez. Here we go. Got him. Rock bottom. Rock bottom. Okay, go up to the top rope. He's gonna fly. Hits that elbow, a single leg drop kick from Edge. Edge is on the attack now. Headbutts, headbutts, headbutts. Keep going with the headbutts, but no. Big slap to the titties from Montez. Here we go. Leapfrog. He's got them hops. Leapfrog. Here we go. Oh, Edge caught him. He caught. Whoa, 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 whoa. Angelo's not even in the match. Montez is up. Big from the heavens. From the heavens. How did this happen? The Street Profits have somehow just picked up a win. Edge just hit a spear. Dawkins wasn't even legal. Montez was able to, to muster the strike to get up to that top rope. And now they just upset Edge and AJ. When you are with me, you are a representation of me. If you are under my control, you have to follow my directions. Since you've proven you can't do that properly, how about I beat it into you? How about I show you what it takes to be on the same level as me by having a match with you at Money in the Bank? Then we can control WWE forever. Oh, AJ. Oh, AJ, he might have snapped out of it all. Oh, he looked to be snapping out of it. Edge saw that and took control, hitting a spear, and now going for it again. He saw that AJ was snapping out of his control, and I guess we're going to have a match at Money in the Bank. Rhea, Becky, any final words before your Raw Women's title bout at Money in the Bank? Last week, Alpha Academy stole my interview time, so now it's time for me to talk. No, 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 no. I can't listen to you and your bullshit. You've done nothing to get this opportunity. You had a chance at the Money in the Bank ladder match, but decided to take me instead. You could have easily won that match. All you had to do was beat Bianca, who I beat in 26 seconds. You better hope I don't break my PB this weekend. Then you have Alexa Bliss, who can't even figure out what her identity is. She needs a stuffed doll to properly function. There's also Asuka, who I gave my women's title to after I went off to become a mother and she threw that away to sasha banks speaking of sasha banks let's not talk about sasha banks then there's her kind of best friend kind of not bailey she used to hug random people now she's got a karen haircut ding dong hello that shit's light work then there's 
Charlotte Flair. Oh, she's so irrelevant, I forgot about Liv Morgan. That shows you how much I think of her. And you chose me over the Money in the Bank ladder match. You have no idea what's coming to you. I need to get on this pay-per-view. We need to get on this stupid pay-per-view. Shut the fuck up. I got a plan. Get that camera out my face. I have a plan. As demanded last week, the Raw Tag Team Champions Alpha Academy will have their first match since winning the titles against Cedric and Shelton of the Hurt Business. Chad Gable was very rude to me last week. I was not appreciative. He interrupted what was supposed to be Rhea Ripley's interview. He actually just kicked her out. And now we have this match because they haven't had a match since they got... Oh! Since they got the Raw Tag Team titles, big headbutt. They won them in a gauntlet and they haven't been seen since. But that's not technically my fault. I know I make the shows, but it's okay. Oh, the sandwich of Shelton Benjamin. And now they're going to go off the ropes. Look at these dorks. Look at these dorks. But Chad Gable... He might be a dork, but that boy can wrestle. He's gonna, is he, I don't, I don't, what, 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 what the fuck just happened? <laughs> Shelton, the veteran. Shelton and Gable used to be a tag team, but now Cedric's in the match, dropping an elbow, but Chad Gable playing a bit of possum here. Double underhook, Tiger, driver, possible, no, just throw him down, that works. Cedric, now two drop kicks, but Chad Gable gonna send him off with his legs, and now here we go, jumping neck breaker. But these two, going back and forth here, big, Forearms, elbows, here we go. Spin an elbow, off the ropes, running at him. Big forearm clothesline. That's not a forearm, that's a clothesline. But Chad Gable's trying to move, but Cedric Alexander, whoa, the spin. The spin on that bitch. Oh, but Chad Gable using a bit of a, a weird offense of whatever the f just happened. And now we're going to get tag team maneuver. Gable, big boot to Cedric. But now Cedric going to fight off against big boy Otis, but no one shot takes him down. He can only go up on the bottom rope. He's a bit, you know, big, but the hot tag to Shelton Benjamin. And now here we go. The strength and a swinging neck breaker from Shelton. Here we go. Exploder suplex into the pen. Otis's foot's near the rope, but Chad Gable, he's, all, he's only one in. Cedric, Cedric was out. He was down and out. Now here we go, up to the top rope, here he goes, moonsault, Cedric could have stopped it, but he didn't, sends off Cedric, and this could be the beginning of the end, roll through, German suplex from Chad Gable, Cedric is nowhere to be found, oh he's there, but it was too late, Alpha Academy win, their first match since winning the Raw Tag Team titles, they beat the Hurt Business, who are on and off, honestly, oh, hey, Seth Rollins, Kevin Owens, Seth Rollins and Kevin Owens, they said that they had a plan. Well, Kevin said he had a plan. They're trying to get on this pay-per-view. Could they be going after the Raw Tag Team Championships? The Alpha Academy said they would defend at Money in the Bank. We do not have much time, but I have to address the final Raw spot in the Men's Money in the Bank ladder match. I canceled the qualifier because I have found a superstar to debut in the final spot. So stay tuned. Cody Rhodes once again has a mystery opponent for his WWE Championship. Who will it be this week? It was Veer Mahan last week, but who? Holy motherfucking shit. It's Omos, the seven foot three, 400 pound Nigerian giant. Oh my Omos. Cody gonna have his work cut out for him cuz god damn that dude is massive It's for the winged eagle championship. Hold that bitch up breath. All right, here we go Oh, and Omos already catching him one right takes him out. Oh my god He might retear his peck headbutt takes him down, but no Cody's got the leg. It's oh no that doesn't matter Oh look how tiny Cody looks Cody is not a tiny guy, but he's doing He's doing shoulder presses, and now he's slamming his head against the mat, but no, Cody looking to fight him. No, no. <laughs> he fight him. No, oh, shit. He just gets thrown down like it's nothing, and now shoved away like a little ant. Went for a big boot, and look at the speed of Omos. Sending him off the ropes. Got him. Popping him up. Oh, Samoan drop from Omos. But Cody, he's still going to do it. He's going to figure out a way, but he's going to get shoved right back down, and now he's going for a dead lift power bomb. Off the ropes he goes. Oh, that size 87 boot. And now he's gonna look for, no. Cody, here we go. Here we go, send him out of the ring. Up to the top rope. Omos is down on the outside. Moon salt to the outside, but now we're back in the ring here. But no, Omos, he doesn't even have a full grip on him. And he's lifting him with ease, gut wrench. Now, Omos, 
gets caught, but no, slaps that bitch away and just runs a Mack truck throw him, sidewalk slam, and now he's gonna go for that finishing maneuver, just grab him by the neck and toss him right back down. Could we have a new champion, Omos, in quick fashion? No, Cody, hanging on to the WWE Championship for now. Ah, oh, ha, ha, ha. That hurt me physically, but no, Cody, how are you doing this? Mr. Rhodes, how could you possibly? And now he hits the crossroads on Omos. That could do it for big boy Omos. Not even two and a half. Oh my God, and up to the top rope, Swanton Bomb. But no, Omos, that backbreaker. Oh, off the ropes, disaster kick. Disaster kick for Cody. Oh no, Omos, oh shit, but no. Big boy kick, now it doesn't even take him down. Oh, running straight at him, and now oh, summon that boot that's bigger than his head. No, I'm getting a fall out of steam. But no, Cody, oh, and almost don't feel that. Almost don't feel that shit. And now he's gonna put him up on the top rope. Ref, you might wanna get out, cause this might break the goddamn ring. The super flex, no, the ring is intact. The ring is intact with a fall away slam. Now stepping on him. Here we go, what the hell? Going for an Alabama slam. And he could be putting the finishing touches on this thing. No, wait, Cody, Cody, he's rolling him up. He could go. <laughs> Cody catches him. Just when you think Cody's down and out, he somehow finds a way to pull through. Cody Rose retains the winged eagle for the fourth time. But he's got to have an opponent money in the bank. And Vinny Mac, he going to talk to us for a second. Cody, you figured out a way to beat everything I've thrown at you, even the NDAs, but I need you to defend that money in the bank. I've turned to one person, my own son. Cody Rhodes, I'll see you at money in the bank.